Welcome guys, on today's video, we are going to be listing top 10 best test-to-speech tools that you can use to create test-to-speech on 2024. And we are going to be doing this, not paying attention to the best ones, but rather we are going to be listing them from all of the tools that is capable of generating test-to-speech. I'm not paying attention to the best ones, so I'm not listing them from the top one to the worst one no so now let's get on with this morph is actually on the number one morph is actually a test to speech um, that actually allows you to create test to speech like a regular voice and it also has an online video maker with morph you can create engaging voiceover from scratch in minute Morph test to speech software has over 120 male and female AI natural sounding voice. It also has this in more than 20 country. You can choose an AI voice of your choice from the project language like French, German, Hindu, Italy, Arabic, and much more. The best part is that um, you won't have to spend a dime to explore all of the future available in the studio. With more free trial, you can access all of the 120 AI voices in the Morph library. You can even switch between the different voices customization option to see how each feature affects the voiceover. Now, play with the pronunciation and pauses and also explore Morph's emphasis and speed and also voice changer features. Um, you can even use music from Morph's library and it actually has over 8,000 8, 8, um, royalty free music tracks. But do not do, not do that guys. Do not use any free uh, royalty music. I do not trust them. Their licenses expire later on so it's very risky. And then guys, um, consider trying Morph. Morph is actually the first one on my list. And guys, they have so many other options that makes it um, special. So Morph is also a very special um, AI software that can help you to generate test to speech. Now, the second one is Neutral Reader. Now, Neutral Reader test to speech software is among the voice generation, um, generation tool that offers likely AI voices um, sorry, um, it's a more neutral reader test to speech software is among the voice generators that offers lifelike AI voice. I hope you actually understand that. This means that the voice sound more like a real life voice. So it sounds like a very close to a human voice or human voice. Now, the natural reader is actually um, actually has a free plan that gives users a different choice that gives users a choice of different synthesis voices in eight different languages. The application converts text from documents of all formats, um, be, be it uh, TST, which is actually just text document, which is DOC, and then EPUB document. Additionally, it uses optional characters recognition, OCR, Technology to let users scan and scan any test and turn it to speech. This is especially um, this is especially beneficial when using an app as a grammar um, as a grammar assistant. This is very useful. A lot of people that just want to use it as a grammar assistant, this is just best. Um, users can also interact with the application's speed sliding to choose um, their desired uh, re um, their desired reading speed it also highlights the voice the words uh, being read aloud in real time the, the said that said natural reader test to speech service is uh, also available on iOS and Android store and also the AI tool generator can be used for free and all of these features mentioned above can be accessed without send, um, spending any amount of money to the creators now this is actually very good because you can use it for free without making use of the special features that was included in the tool now the third one is speechify speechify test to speech software lets you power through documents articles pdfs and much more convert them into a natural sounding speech in a matter of time although this isn't free version available 
there isn't a free version available for these two guys and also users can install the speechify chrome 2 extension and explore the application tts features for um for free whenever it says tts it means test to speech that is actually an abbreviation of um, test to speech is called tts now speechify as well as um Speechify as well as slow down or increase the reading speed easily, but Speechify's plan, Speechify's free plan user can only increase the speed by one times, which is one X. And then the platform currently provides test to speech, natural language in 30 different languages across different accents. But with Speechify's free version, users can only assess the software's test basic to uh, test to speech. Now, that is that for Speechify. The next one is TTS. TTS is another light wave, uh, another lightweight, simple and functional test to speech that works right out of the box in TTS. 30 male and female voices across 15 plus languages. However, the voiceover, the voices are robotic and sound less realistic, which is actually TTS. I've actually made a video about TTS. Now, TTS has a speech, a speech tracking word, a speech tracking, tracking word features that highlight the word being read aloud. A notable aspect of the application is that it lets readers set the reading speed, import um, a web page and add pauses among other features the software requires no installation download or login it works or um, it works on any browser and also on any device furthermore tts reader also re remembers its last test and position henceforth users can always continue um, playing right where they left off if they come back or whenever they come back at automatic and now tts will play from newly selected position all of this is totally free now that is tts reader i've made a video about it and it's actually very cool that is the reason why i made the video about tts reader now the next one guys is lovo lovo is actually a test to speech that offers a free version that lets users instantly create natural sounding voiceover in less time now this this actually allows you to pick your favorite voice from Lovo library of 180 voices in 33 different languages that beat, um, fits your unique content type and tone. Um, enter your script into the application's workspace, use um, the software uh, customization and features to fine tune the voice and also render in minute. Create high quality voiceover for any type of content and also with Lovo's free plan, users can access um, all of its uh, unlimited conversation and can also listen to it as well as share the content. Lovo, allows, Lovo AI allows um, up to three downloads per month and three um, day access three daily access to premium voices and also content generated using um, the free plan can only be used for a personal use, not commercial. You do not, um, you're not able to monetize this if you are actually making use of the free plan. But if you want to monetize it, you actually go for the premium. If you are making use of the premium, you can monetize it as you want. Now, the next one is Well Seed Lab. Now, um, I'm actually lost count, guys. I'm going to put that while I'm um, captioning it. So, Well Said Lab, this is actually a extremely powerful test to speech um, free uh, software or free plan package as a pump. Now, users can use the studio for a free for free for up to seven days by simply signing up with their um, email ID. And then it's important to note that Well Said Lab doesn't allow users to sign up with um, their personal email IDs for some reason. I do not know why. With, um, with the software's free plan, you can create only, um, only one project, but access um, about 52 uh, voices avatar, create up to 50, 50 uh, audio files, and explore all the functionalities of the studio. But all of this, you can only do it in one day. This is so weird. And you can only create one project with it. Well said, Lab. Um, guys, 
I would try it, but I might not stick with it. The next one is Balabulka. Balabuka test to speech is a free test to speech software. Balabuka uses a various version of Microsoft Speech API to alter voice parameters such as rate and pitch. And while Balabuka doesn't offer AI voices of its own, all computer generated installed on the system on a system are available to Balabuka. And it can be used for test to speech conversion balabuka can work only on windows devices balabuka uh, provides a range of different configuration um, option that allows you to change various settings including the type of voice articulation rate quality file size etc with balabuka you can save the file in different formats like mp3 with wma ogg and mp4 for light for lengthier article you can also add bookmark to it to make it easy to return to a certain point there are also uh, great features available uh, to assist you in personalizing pronunciation in words now this only works in windows so i think it's going to be disadvantaged to a lot of people now um word talk the next one is word talk now, what talk test to speech generation service is a finite, is a beneficial to people with reading and writing difficulties. Um, what talk is a plugin that works in Microsoft um, that works in Microsoft Word and in Windows PC only. It is effortlessly and it can be found under the adding adding tabs um, as simple as it may sound. Uh, what talk offers a range of services. And for starters, it highlights the parts being read and has a talking dictionary um, integrated. Uh, boots, voice, and speed can be modified. Um, users can also save files um, either in WAV or a MP4. Sorry, in MP3. It is not. Um, it is not for profit, which means it's actually an open source tool. No cap and a numbering of word it can read. Now, guys, uh, the next one is Voice Dream Reader. Now, Voice Dream Reader is only available for Apple user. This application has about um, 61 voices that can be used for free. Additionally, Voice Dream Reader supports say, um, synchronized highlights highlighting, which makes it easier to read. Um, almost all test files of files format are supported almost all test files format are supported the contest to be read uh to be read can be uploaded from multiple sources including notes taking up like pocket and evernote and also the cloud solution provides provided like google drive and icloud that is all voice dream reader can be used offline and doesn't uh, require an active internet to be used now the next one is copy voice copy voice is actually a free test to speech service available as a browser extension and it lets users listen to the web article and format the web pages test um, to make it easier to be read now copy um, copy voice improves productivity and makes reading and and makes reading more enjoyable it's actually a great um, assistant tool for people who um, experience challenges such as uh, vision loss, um, dyslexia, ADHD, and motor impairments. It's actually a free TTS tool, which is also um, which also has an optional in purchases rather. Now, um, guys, these are actually everything for. Um, test to speech but now the limitation of free test to speech online is actually that um, the version of the most test to speech generated app only gives glimpse of what the app can do but if you go into the premium you are going to see a lot of things that the app can do for instance you can be using something and the voice might not be sounding so real or let's say you cannot actually control the speed of the talking or the note um, is actually going to be a disability to you making use of the app. But if you actually have an option and if you are also able to um, 
make this talk faster or make it read faster then it's actually to an advantage to you and also most of them will not allow you to save in different formats so i think you should consider um the one that should be best to you so you should know what you are going for so after going through all of this you can try some of them and see how it works i just made it easy for you by listing the features so um let me know the one that works for you or the one you decide to use but these are all of the best ones for 2024 and if there are anything or any changes i am going to make more video about it guys thank you for watching stay safe and